Ten Pin Alley, here we are! Pinky, are you pondering what I'm pondering? I think so, Brain. But this time, you get to feed the alligator. No, Pinky. Bowling, the sport of pharaohs. Here's our chance to take over the world! <laughs> what are we doing here? We can't bowl! Yeah, we ain't even got thumbs. The God Pigeon says we're gonna bet on the winner and make a killing. But how do we know who will win? <laughs> Are you spying on me? Are you spying on me? The gob pigeon says take it easy and don't bowl so good. You might just sleep a bit better tonight. Get the picture? The god pigeon wants to show you what happened to the last bowler that didn't do what he was told to. I shall construct a hypnotic bowling ball that will put everyone in the world in my power. My hypnotic bowling ball is now complete. Next, I must test its effectiveness. Do you know what this is, Pinky? It's a giant meatball! Yum! What do we eat? And you're a giant meathead. Just watch the meatball. No! Yes! It works! The world will soon be mine! Win this round, Pinky. You must bring me my ball. Okay. Pinky, when we get home, remind me to hurt you. Oh yeah. It's my world. The rest of you are just paying rent. Now, Pinky, bring me my ball. Here you go, Blaine. I had it bronzed for you as a memento of this marvelous occasion. I'm mortified. Come on, Pinky. Where are we going? Home to prepare for tomorrow's tournament. What are we gonna do then? The same thing we do every night, Pinky. Try to take over the world! <laughs> Run, Pinky! Run for your life! <laughs> The God Pigeon thanks you for losing the tournament here. Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! In one form or another, bowling has been enjoyed by people around the world for several thousand years. The Bowling Hall of Fame and Museum preserves bowling's unique and colorful past. Here, visitors can trace bowling's roots from ancient Egypt to the modern game enjoyed by millions worldwide. With three levels and 50,000 square feet of space, there are a wide variety of displays and exhibits that bring this sport to life. Ten Pin Alley introduces bowling's rich history beginning in 3200 BC and traces its development throughout numerous European countries before it made its way to America in the 1600s. From here, visitors can follow its progression to the modern game played today. Hometown Heroics is a hands-on exhibit which allows visitors to look up sanctioned 300 games and 800 series as well as local Hall of Famers from around the country. Visitors will enjoy a short movie showing the many forms of bowling that are played throughout France, England, Germany, and many other countries of the world. The museum also features four state-of-the-art lanes and four old-time alleys, 
Every visit includes complimentary bowling, and visitors can even bowl in the old-time alleys where human pin setters rack them up. Visitors can get to know the heroes of the game as they explore several halls of fame, including the American Bowling Congress Hall of Fame, the Women's International Bowling Congress Hall of Fame, as well as the PBA and BPAA Halls of Fame. The Bowling Hall of Fame also features a museum store where visitors can purchase unique, one-of-a-kind gifts. Items are also available by mail, and interested parties are invited to call for a free catalog. The Bowling Hall of Fame and Museum is open year-round in downtown St. Louis, just a few blocks from St. Louis's famous Arch and next door to Bush Stadium. On your next trip to St. Louis, be sure to plan a trip to this unusual and intriguing museum. We hope to see you in St. Louis. Special delivery for the Warners. Look, we're going bowling. And it'll be in 3D. What's 3D? Digitally developed for dollars. No, wait. I want to do it again. Hello. Whee! Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Aries. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And now, the winner is... Thank you, thank you, thank you.